This is fine. <laughs> this is this is okay. This is we're just gonna we're gonna go in a game and we're gonna complete hollow to hard mode whatever thing. Okay. Tarot cards or breastplate or sausage. We'll grab the tarot cards. Okay, we're gaming. We're we're officially gaming. Is the game lagging for you guys or is that just me? Also, it looks like we're doing a lot more damage than we usually do. I like the idea of throwing more tarot cards. That's fine. We're also fighting new enemies on the first round in the hard mode, which is cool. Mama! Every four seconds, heal 1% for each target within 100 pixels, up to 10%. Or we get cheerful laugh. The closer the target is within 100, the damage, they did, they did, we do more damage. I like the idea. Flower, we take those. Those are free. Free. Good items. Free good items are always happy with me. Um... We'll keep on upgrading the tarot cards because that could get really interesting really fast. Wonder if I can kill any of those? No. They have too much HP. Looks like we're doing status effects each time we hit them. Which is interesting. Or we're... No, no, we're de-shielding them maybe. Uh, tarot cards has a 10% chance to create an omen, dealing 200% damage to targets. If omen defeats a target, the special meter fills slightly. That... is cool. Because we can start spamming our special. Which could get really interesting with this character. I've always liked characters in games that shoot cards. Like Twisted Fate and like League and stuff. I don't like League of Legends as much anymore though, so don't talk to me about it ever. But, um, this is pretty interesting. Raver guy down. That was a lot of damage we just did. Also, my hair is getting in my face! Okay. I can see again. I can see. Sheesh. Um, tarot cards. Level 3. Throw 4 tarot cards. You got it. I think... Cad, you just hit me up in the DMs, but I'm not able to see it at the very moment because it's cut off by a thing. And if I tab out, the game goes on full screen. Okay. When hitting a target, there's a 30% chance that the target may lose 20% attack speed or take 20% more damage. I like that. I like that. So th this is the awakened version of it, which is really good. We'll grab... Omen. Let's check out what Omen do. So it's a left and right ability. And it's kind of broken. That's pretty good. I enjoy this character. Because if we can start spamming this boy, we're going to be... We're going to be vibrating, bro. Um, if we reduce special cooldown as well, we can really start spamming these abilities. That might make getting through hard mode not too bad. We just need some movement speed and, um, a dream and a dream. We killed him somehow. Overtime damage? Cutting board? Overtime damage? Or something, maybe? I don't know. Perhaps. Okay, we'll go with this. Um, every four seconds, heal 1% for each. Healing is really good. We wouldn't have survived hard that one hard mode unless we had some sort of lifesteal. Or some sort of like really good survivability. So I'm going to go for more survivability again. If there's a revive, that's going to be epic. We also just got three hollow zones. Let's go. We take, we take, we take. Those are free. That's what's good. And then we grab more idle for more of those, or do we grab more damage around us? I think we'll go for more damage around us. That sounds legit. I, 
kind of want to just use our super as much as we can because I feel like we're going to be able to start using this a lot more often. Especially the more omen we get. Um, fan beam on this map might be pretty good. Maybe it, we get some like cutting board mixtures or something. We'll grab the idol. <laughs> Look, we'll choose a thing that I didn't speak about at all and came up with like no theory of not if it was good or not. The life still seems like it's doing pretty well. This is a broken item. We take that. Yes, sir. Or ma'am. Sausage would be pretty nice right now. Not really. That's cap. We're still missing out on a few collabs. But we are in hard mode. That's a bad position to be in. But there's a burger. I love burger. Okay. Um, Psycho Axe can pair well with the book. Idol costume. I'm not afraid. On guard me with lasers. Can't handle this. Can't fight me. Get out of here with your sans fight self. Got a bomb cat coming in? Oh, just a boss. We're gonna go ahead and just yeah. You know what I mean? Just, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Get punched to death. Uh, free item. And then we'll go for Cheerful Laugh. I don't know why this is like part of her kit. The more damage they receive. Like, it's not specific on like how much more damage they receive. It could be a lot, though. Or it could be not that good. We're going to take the speed, even though it gives us less HP. This character does seem to have, like, a decent amount of HP anyways. We're only going to grab, like, one of those, though. On purpose, anyways. This is no good. Chilling? Ooh, we'll grab the book. Ooh, we'll grab the book. Increased damage of 5% per empty weapon slot. That's not going to be us for long. That might be good for challenges. Because if it's like a, a challenge where you can't have any weapons really, like that's like the only way you'll, you'll survive through this. That's pretty interesting. We'll grab another cutting board because I want them to stay away from me. We might have used that too soon. It seems like we're killing them though. It's just going right through them and we're doing so much damage. We'll upgrade you. No. No, we won't. We'll swap you. We'll upgrade you. Finish. Boom, bop, bam. Done. Yes. Let's go. Glow stick or heal? I need, I need like the revive feather, yo. The revive feather is kind of important, like really important. <laughs> Ooh, free item. We're gonna do this. I wanna break through this. And then. That felt like the right move. I can't believe we're actually able to kill some of these, like, event type enemies with the kit that we have right now. It feels like we have a lot of, a lot more damage than usual. Movement speed? Yeah. 
Yeah, we take movement speed. We have two ravers. Wait, I just realized we're like doing the uh, like JoJo stand thing. Wait a second. I see. We can do it so often. That might be the, our ticket to surviving throughout this like hard mode run. That's very possible. We don't take breastplate. Ooh, these are kind of tricky. I'm really hoping we don't get another water bottle or energy bottle because I feel like that'd be bad. We are doing the aura aura. We really do be doing the aura aura. I've actually only seen golden wind. Don't cancel me. I like it because it was like Jojo. Golden win. I can't sing worth anything, bro. But they like they like say the Jojo, Golden win. Jojo. <laughs> Verse, right? Da 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 We're gonna we're just gonna start punching. I feel embarrassed. That's why I started a punching this time. Um Honestly, for seven minutes in, it feels like we're doing pretty okay. These guys will keep us the cutting boards will keep them off our backs because we're forward aiming character. Which seems to pair well. Honestly goes well with like most characters. Just I don't think it would work well with like the aura characters, like something that like circles around you type thing as your main attack. You can use this so often. You need to die. You need to die right now. You gotta go. You got you got you gotta go. Thank you. Thank you. So we have a cutting board and a book. Perhaps they can combine, but maybe maybe they don't combine. Who knows? If we get a golden anvil, that'd be sick to see it. But I have no idea. We'll base our next weapon pickups based on if we've gotten a combo with it or not. Because I want something new. We have... Huh. We increase attack size and knockback effects by weapons by 10%. Also increase pickup range by 30%. Or we just grab the axe. I don't know. I feel like we're gaming. It feels like they're getting stronger. It's starting to scare me. Our damage seems to be not as amazing as it used to be. But we are getting our super all the time, so. What do you do? Reduce the time between attacks by 15%. That's kind of cool. Our crit chance is 11%. Plus 15%. No, wait, plus 0%. We aren't critting that often anyways. That felt like the right move. Ooh, we have no more rerolls. Um, every 10 seconds, food will drop closely. Also increase food drop chance from defeated targets by 10%. Or we grab Mama. We could grab Mama. I guess we're going to grab Mama. I feel like that wasn't really a choice. They forced me to pick Mama right there. 
Which could, we could, you could turn out to be a good thing that we got mama. Oh, okay. We dodging. We dodging. We dodging. <laughs> Sausage plus cutting board collaboration, perhaps. I mean, that does sound logical. But, but that may not be a thing. I can't believe we survived through that. That is pretty dope. Surviving through waves is awesome. So far we're nine minutes in, almost halfway through our main point. Okay. Plug type. What is plug type? What does this mean? What is a plug type Asakako? Also Coco in real life though. Like what really are you saying? Like in like what words? What is that? Cause it kinda looks like a scorpion tail. Oh, we're fighting you already? And you Get me out of here! Let me out! Are we dead. I, I killed my, I, that was me. That was absolutely my fault in every way. And I'm sorry. And I understand if you're disappointed in me, we have something. I don't know what they're saying. That doesn't mean I can't enjoy this though. I love this art style and all the animation. Really jet set radio vibes. Okay. Is this the guy that's doing the punchies? By the way, I would let you know of what we were reacting to if I knew what it said. Killer solo. You tear up that keytar piano thing. This is awesome. Just watching the meteors fall into the city. This is cool. Colors are awesome. So is she not from Earth?
this is credits. I know that enough. That was really cool. That was really interesting. I don't have a way of translating this, but this is really cool. Okay. 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 Things are starting to make more sense. The lore is hitting better and I'm understanding things. We'll, we'll, we'll spin the wheel. That was fascinating. Okay, so who are we playing now? Muna Hoshinova. I feel like I've played you before. Ooh, we're on like the third row. This is new. Did I already miss you? No, we did not. So we have a purple haired anime girl. And uh, she has an ability called Crescent Moon. Throws a spinning crescent at an arc in front. Transforms into the true moon goddess form. Okay. Check out what that really means though. To increase this attack size. Okay. So she tosses out like a boomerang type thing. And it has a pretty wide attack area, which is kind of nice. Moon song. Every 10 seconds, Muna sings to create a small moving orb of music that draws targets in, slowly dealing 100% damage per half a second. Gain Hashinova buff. Hashinova. Hoshinova. Hoshinova buff. Increasing attack by 20% of taking damage. Hoshinova becomes Muna for 5 seconds, reducing damage taken by 15 instead. I like that. That sounds cool. There's a black hole. I like uh, it's like a black. Okay, we got another new thing. Lunar construction. Targets may drop lunar blocks. At five blocks, Muna creates a lunar rabbit, which explodes on nearby targets, dealing 300% damage. If Luna Lunar Rabbit defeats a target, gains special meter. Okay, cool. What my blocks? We got a block. That's pretty cool. I like block. We got three block. Where my rabbit at? Need two more. We'll grab this one because now we're gonna be we're gonna be doing a lot of new things. Did we got a rabbit? It killed a thing. Our special meter goes up. Interesting. We'll grab the buff. We're gonna get hit by that. <laughs> Okay, that rabbit is really good. Let's see if we can hit that bomb. This is a very interesting character. There's a lot of moving pieces and I like it. The attack speed is pretty slow, or at least the attack pattern is kind of wonky, but I mean, I can get used to this. Let's see this. I'm surprised things are just not disappearing like I'm like I feel like this character is like super celestial and doing a lot of really cool things but like I feel like that should like insta kill like look how big and cool it looks like this, this character has to be some sort of spirit entity or goddess or some sort you grab the revive Interesting. Our special ability meter doesn't go up as fast as I would like it to go up based on the rabbit kill thing. Well, that's okay. I think things are going to work out fine. Uh, we'll grab this. I want more rabbit. Get out of there. Okay, we got our first boss. Can you actually escape that? You fat cat. How did you do that? Give me blocks so I can blow up the, the boss. There we go. See if this will even kill you. Will one of my abilities? Yeah, I can get rid of a boss. I think we already did a lot of damage. We'll reduce the damage speed. Or increase the 
rate of attack. That sounds like a good idea. And we'll get more blocks and more moon stuff going on. More moon stuff. The moon being bigger is a huge plus. Wow, they're, we're taking damage right now. This might be GG. I don't feel like every character hits five. Every five hits creates a full moon. Yo, if I don't get like a special, like right now we might die. We're good. We're chilling. Every five hits creates this full moon. So it's... I see what's going on. <laughs> so when we get like a big group of enemies, we do we do a lot of damage. That's pretty cool. So she's kind of like a slow burner. Things get really crazy over time. We'll grab the plug type of Sakoko. Fascinations, yo. This is really cool. Um, I don't know if we're going to be able to survive hard mode with this character, though. By all means, I'm going to try my best, though. I mean, we did. We did, I didn't think I was going to survive the last hard mode stage with the character I had, but yeah, we did. I feel like that's not very good. Damaging, general. We'll grab more Asakako. Coco. That was really fast. <laughs> Did I like skip it? Life seal would be pretty nice. Um, more survivability is nice. I'd rather have attack speed though. So we'll go for damage for right now. Also, I realize I've been saying we're, we're killing the monsters. We're saving the fans. I keep on forgetting. Like I look at the hearts and then it reminds me we're saving these people. We're doing a net positive in the moral compass, not, no negative. These fans have just been corrupted. And they come from all places of the universe. Get destroyed. Okay, we grab this. This, this should help. I love sending the rabbit after them. I don't really know what decides how, where the black hole goes. It might just be my mouse cursor. Saki would be pretty cool. But that being max level is even cooler. I don't know why I have this tendency to like talk about other things and then like pick a different one, dude. It's just like, a, it's just a habit of some sort, I think. We grab that. It's free. Apply. Confirm. Doesn't do anything good really for us besides get us gold, but we take those. We have a boss. We have two bosses. And we have two ravers. That's so interesting that we don't I feel like it should just kill everything. If we grab... 
we need some sort of more like because we kind of keep them away but we need more things that like yeah this might work this might work if we could get maybe um something that makes our attacks bigger that could become pretty awesome this is just just not a good time right now We still have another life just in case, but... I'm gonna do that for the attack speed. And then, um... Another attack speed. Okay! This could save our run, depending on what we get. Please don't be money related. <laughs> oh, wait, this is good. At every minute an anvil repair <laughs> okay wait 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 that's really good that's really good we just can't die like right now or we'll never be able to like see like the create power that of an item of what we just got is that's really good because we have 13 more minutes until the boss that means 13 free upgrades on top of our leveling that's really good. That's just like spells like insane run, right? As long as we don't just die on for free type thing. Well, no one can save me if I'm stupid. Oh no! Okay, um, we grab more damage there. There's our first anvil that we will use to upgrade you. This is when the, me being stupid really is going to hurt us. Please die. Please! BE DEAD! Gonna revive once. We still have more revives. Our damage is so low! Please just die. Um... It's dead. It's dead and we lived. We are barely lived. Get me out of here! <laughs> We're gonna grab this just in case I die again. That was important. That was a good timing for that. We'll grab the curse thing. Oh man, this is tricky. This is very tricky. There's our next anvil. Can max that out. That's really nice, actually. We want this. We'll grab some more. I don't know, man. I don't know. Somebody got to take the game away from me. Okay, we're, we're, we're chilling. That looks like some sort of a boss-y-like object. I guess it wasn't really. I want to get done with this phase as soon as possible. We need a... Body pillow and or healing item. That's what we're like getting destroyed on mostly right now. Two of those. Get me out! <laughs> oh my gosh. Ah! 
Just circle, just circle. And we have that guy on us. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, this is this is much unfortunateness. This is very unfortunate. What if I just run away from him? Can I just get away from you? I don't want to fight anymore. I see ya. I don't, I don't want to play anymore with you. That one chases. That one we need to be near. But not when you're on a wall! Are you crazy? Wait, we run back now. We grab the... We grab the anvil. We upgrade this. For free. We move back in. Slowly. We get another free anvil. We upgrade you. Wait, we can enchant you. We can't. <laughs> we upgrade you. We just took so much damage. She's about to do some crazy stuff. I don't care about the hollow coins anymore. We have one revive left. We're gonna use it. We're gonna we're gonna see if we can at least take out one of them. If we take out one of them. We can take out two of them. We can't die. We can die. But we we can't die, you know what I mean? Please be the best item I've ever picked up in my life. Sure. Wait, 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 Is that another boss? You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. No! No! This is so hard. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna re-roll again. I'm gonna beat this. I'm gonna beat this level three. Goofy goober. Level three. <laughs> level three level. Nekomata Ak Akio. Nekomoto Akio. You. Okay, before we play her, we need to check out lore on Muna Hishinova. Music and concept by Muna Hashinova. It's English? This is dope? What do you see? It's a fire beat. Dang, this is really cool. It's like EDM. I love EDM. Oh man. This is really cool. Can be 
got like the trap hats on it, yo. Not learning much about her lore though. From this. This is crazy. Bad person or a good person, Mrs. Muna Hashinova? You got some, like, you got some scary eyes sometimes. She's got, like, two sides to her. She's, like, this human, then also a celestial being. These kind of visuals would go really well if they did like a really big concert or something with all these different music videos and stuff. This would be really cool. This would be really cool. I would go. Because <laughs> it just would look cool. She's like a weird like time traveling being or something, yo. Because now she, she she had like this like attack on Titan Mikasa type outfit going on. And then she's she also has her like Celestial Bing. And now she has her like modern like cyberpunk-esque type fit going on. She's interesting. She's very interesting. <laughs> 